You realize how short your dog's life is. How can you extend their life and make their later years a lot more comfortable? Learn what supplements age my dog backwards and what mistakes most dog owners make that shortens their dog's life. Do not overfeed your dog. Obesity is the number one reason for early aging in dogs. When they get older, their metabolism slows down and they don't move around as much. You should be able to feel the ribs of a healthy weight dog. A 2011 study found that dogs that eat about 25% less than the normal recommended amount of food live an average of two years longer. The recommended portion might be an evil trick to get you to consume and buy more dog food. Speaking of food, feed your older dog natural high quality food or at least avoid meat byproducts that aren't certified and foods with unnecessary fillers. Avoid food with less than 20% crude protein. Not only are we asking you to feed your dog high quality food, also consider hot and cold foods. For dogs in warm climate, try to feed them cold foods like fish. And for dogs in cold climate, try to feed them warm foods like pork and lamb. This will make it easier on them to regulate their body temperature. Also, keep in mind to store your dog's food properly to avoid food poisoning, rancid kibble, infiltration by pets, and bacterial infections. Another thing to avoid in food is chemicals. Many artificial preservatives are used to extend the dog's food shelf life, but they should not be consumed. Chemicals like BHA, BHT, or ethoxyquin should not be eaten. Also avoid chemicals in grooming products and medications. These nasty chemicals can cause your dog's organs to work overtime, shortening their lifespan. Other containments to watch for is heavy metals or chlorine in your dog's water. Filter his water and serve it to him in a stainless steel or glass bowl. Plastic and plastic derivatives can leach in your dog's water and should not be consumed. If you are avoiding all that, what should your older dog eat? One thing you need to add to his diet is probiotics. They will help your dog digest food, absorb vitamins, and keep a strong immune system. They do always help with diarrhea if your dog is having an issue with that. Next thing to add to your dog's diet is glucosamine and chondroitin. When my dog reached nine years old, I noticed stiffness and limping after getting down from the couch. After starting him on glucosamine and chondroitin, he's back to jumping up and down the couch with no visible pain. My new vet even asked if I'm sure he's nine years old because he appears younger. According to our latest research, UC2 works better than the combination of chondroitin and glucosamine. We haven't tried it yet, but the studies look promising. What is UC2? It's a type 2 collagen that comes from chicken sternum cartilage. Type 2 collagen is primarily present in the joint cartilage and makes up most of its composition. It's supposed to be more effective because it undergoes minimal processing. And if your dog already has arthritis, green-lipped muscles can help manage inflammation and pain. Omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids will also help your dog. They are good to support brain health, skin and coat, joint mobility, heart health, eye health, and immunity. Keep in mind that supplements don't reverse damage, so start them as early as you can. And of course, like humans, dogs need antioxidants. Berries like blueberries are at the top of the list for your dog but apples also have the added beneficial probiotic fibers. A more recent breakthrough in senior dog nutrition is the use of medium-chain triglyceride oils, MC oils, to support cognitive health. When dogs get old, their brain lose the ability to use glucose as the primary energy source. It can affect their memory. MCT oils can provide the brain with an alternative energy source, improving their cognitive functioning. Keep in mind, with all the supplements that you're using, not to overdose your dog. Some senior foods already include vitamins in the food, so make sure you look at the dosage as you add additional supplements. For non-food items, get your dog a pheromone diffuser. This will reduce levels of stress for your dog and extend their life. Stress does kill not only humans, but also dogs. Another way to de-stress is to keep your dog active, which will also help them keep muscles, which support their joints. With good muscle tone, your dog's mobility won't drop off drastically. Also, consider physical therapy for dogs that seem to have issues with mobility. Water therapy has worked wonders in dogs. If you keep their body healthy, you also have to keep their mind healthy. As with aging humans, cognitive function declines with age. 
There are many activities and toys that will help keep your dog mentally stimulated. So instead of making your dog run as it used to when it was young, consider a sniffari. Dogs explore their world through sniffs, so hiding treats in your daily walk will be a cool adventure that will keep their mind sharp. There are also numerous puzzle games that will engage your dog's brain. As your dog ages, you might notice that they lose some of their senses. For dogs losing eyesight, they might have trouble navigating their environment. Try to keep your furniture layout consistent and not move things around to prevent accidental bumps. For dogs losing hearing, don't approach them from behind to prevent startling. Be aware that you might have to monitor them more closely as they might not be able to hear traffic and put themselves in danger. For dogs losing their mobility, install carpet runners for them on slippery wood floors and get stairs for dogs that used to jump on furniture so they don't strain themselves. Another big strain on older dogs' health is teeth. Keep your dog's teeth clean. Bacteria in the plaque can enter the bloodstream and spread many health problems to dogs. Also, if you don't clean your dog's teeth thoroughly, your dog might have to be put under anesthesia for the removal of decayed teeth. Older dogs might not have organs healthy enough to undergo that surgery. Maintaining your dog's teeth clean is important, but so is maintaining their nails at a proper length. As dogs age, they might slow down their usual activity level, and while it was okay to only cut your dog's nails once a month before, now, due to inactivity, you might have to cut them twice a month because they aren't naturally filing them down. Keeping them at the right length will also help them with grip and will prevent falling and slipping accidents. To prevent further accidents, research your dog's breed. Is your dog's breed prone to certain health issues that you can help prevent, mitigate, or control? For example, King Charles Cavaliers are prone to heart issues, so monitoring the heart at his vet checkups is important. German Shepherds are prone to hip and elbow dysplasia, which can be monitored by keeping an eye out on their walk. To further prevent accidents, dog-proof your home. Sometimes, dogs pass away because of accidents. Cords that can be chewed through and cause electrical issues can lead to your dog's death. Also, teach your dog commands that can save their lives. Teach your dog to stay in case he ever runs away, which happens more often than we would like to think. He won't run away into oncoming traffic because he will know the stay command while you get your leash secured on him. Another life-saving command is to teach your dog to drop it. This comes in especially handy if your dog gets into food he shouldn't have. This can prevent him from consuming something that can kill him. If you live in a cold climate with snow, shovel your porch before you let your dog outside to prevent him from hurting himself when he slips. And even if you have the most beautiful floors, have carpets for the dog to prevent slipping, especially if they are getting older. Stay disciplined, not just in your home maintenance, but also in general when it comes to your dog. A little piece of pizza will not hurt, right? Or he only gets this when my friends visit. It's not a habit. If it's bad for him, restrain yourself and don't shorten your dog's life. Stay educated on recalls. Is your food on recall and you don't know and you're feeding potentially dangerous food to your dog? For other potentially dangerous items, check out our video of dog items you should throw away immediately. It's not all bad news. There is a dog aging project whose goal is to increase the lifespan of your dog. The study looks at potential anti-aging drugs with one of them being rapamycin, a drug that has been found to extend the lives of flies, worms, and mice in labs. It mimics effects of caloric restriction, which has been shown to help multiple species live longer. Who knows, maybe in the future, it will be a common drug to give your dog. Last but not least, this one is a hard one to think about, but know when to say goodbye. As difficult as it might seem, keeping your dog comfortable is knowing when to say goodbye. Talk to your vet about the quality of life to make sure your pet isn't suffering. Sometimes, humans tend to hang on to their pets for their benefits and due to their love, but not letting your dog go when it's the right time can be one of your biggest mistakes. What helped your aging dog? 